You see the early jump in the dive kick from Kazunoko to beat the anti-air attempt. There it is again. Joe gets under, though. Yeah, the dive kick just uh, falling a little bit short. No, no challenge against the V-skill. V Joe gets the dash under, fake, cross under into throw. And you see Joe block, expecting uppercut from Kazunoko, and he's already hitting a button there. Just knows that, yeah, people will respect me. I'm Kazunoko, Ooh. and I might uppercut. Just barely clipped that EX dive kick, and here comes Kazunoko. But you know what? You, you're kind of willing to take that forward throw from Kami when you're not in the corner because you definitely do not get as much pressure follow-up from Kami after that. Yeah, mid-screen, it doesn't lead to much at all. It's not too too dangerous, and Trigger's just about gone for her. Great yep. work. You know, Joe has baited uppercut three or four times, and Kazunoko hasn't done it. And so this time, he does the cross under, goes for the combo, and ends up overhead. Overhead, L.I. Joe taking the first round. Yeah, that was lovely stuff. He, he baited the uppercut a few times, Kazunoko got away with buttons, and he's like, all right, I will commit to my own offense and make something happen, and that's what he did. All right, nice, using the EX Sonic Scythe. Okay, wow, just out of range for the full thing, but still. I think Kazunoko will take that. That's two bars already spent from Joe. But yeah, Joe has really done a great job kind of shutting down the dive kick game from Kazunoko. Getting two Sonic Sights and then punishing it with a low forward on the whiff. But here comes Kazunoko. This is where Kami gets scary. The walk up, throw attack, anti air from the back strong. And man, Kazunoko's in a dangerous spot. A throw will stun, so he's got to be careful. Out Ooh, of there, Joe. I love that crouching short real quick. And then that, that jump back jab that we saw him use so much against Fudo. Oh, he's going to get through with the drill. Spends it. Yeah, huge damage on that. Just needs one more to close off this round. Joe in trouble here. Not a lot of uh, resources to work with. He's getting close to critical art, but not quite. Oh, and there it is. It, love yeah. to confirm. He even confirmed uppercut just in case to get that extra bit of damage if drill wouldn't have killed. So, right, last tie round. 1-1. One, one. We'll Here see if this first game. maybe Joe can slow it down. He's close to critical art, and there's, yeah, Kazuno go through. Not a huge amount of damage, but oh, this is what Kami needs. It just gets you in, and it starts her game. She's so threatening. Oh, she gets, oh big it. damage. He's going to spend the EX instead of saving it for the super. And it was huge damage. I totally agree with it. Now he's got to be careful. Hoping maybe he could build up another bar, possibly, to get the super confirmed towards the end of this round. But just, you know, he's just trying to kill off the time of that V, e -trigger. v trigger, and he did it. Oh, so she's only had it. one move. Did go for the EX Sonic Scythe? Block from Joe, hanging out. Got the confirm, and that's gonna be enough first game. Li Joe over Kazunoko. And look at Li Joe. He knows, and you know what? In the background, Moons, his Li training partner, one of his best friends, cheering him on. The audience chanting, Joe! He just one. needs one more for top eight here at Evo. And he's got to keep up this defense. That's the most important part. I feel like I was just going to say, there's a jump. But besides Ooh. that, Joe has done such a great job of being a wall and just stopping all these dive kicks, as you mentioned. Wow, one of the first time Kazunoko's kind of gone for that throw tick. And Joe actually uh, teched it. But here comes Kazunoko again, getting the counter hit from Joe pushing buttons. And that's a stun, not quite yet. Oh, one more for stun. Great block, but then opened up by the low. This should be a clean round for Kazunoko, and it is. That's that's always a discouragement if you're a, the person who wins the first game, and then all of a sudden the opponent comes back and wins a solid first round. Yeah, convincing stuff. We saw that opener last time. Kazunoko dashes and then buffers just in case he throws a fireball. As soon as you do, EX drill right through. Keeps up yeah. the pressure, counter hit confirms. Yeah, Joe hitting buttons in those situations. And now Kazunoko's got Joe really flustered and confused about what he should do. I think mostly he's tightened up the offense so much. Joe, there's no escape. Oh, got let's her? just do it. Yeah, just reversal critical art. He's going to get a huge chunk of damage on this. He can have mix up here if he wants it. We'll see if he dashes in or not. He does. Oh, but, but he drops, drops the, the com combo. Oh, no, this is huge swing. Great block from Joe. And he avoids the, 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 the trigger dive kick, but Kazunoko right on the cusp of oh, it. And the throw tech, yeah, gets beaten out by EX dive kick. Kazunoko ties it up so quickly. Some Street Fighter 4 yeah. tactics right there. Instant EX dive kick from Kazunoko beating out the throw tech. It's going to be one game apiece now. Joe, really, the defense there was not what it needed to be, right? Yeah. And it's so tough. The options. Uh, you know, the wheel of options that Kami has, and Kazunoko, you know, switches between them so well. And that's how Kami, beat, Kami beats you, you know? It's, you know, the it sounds simple, throw or frame trap, but when it's executed so pro properly, it is so devastating to deal with. Oh, mix-up was so tough to see. He uses drill at the end of that for positioning. 
Joe once again trapped in the corner. And again, same sequence. And Joe keeps hitting the button and then gets caught into the throw bait. Here comes Kazunoko. Basically, he's telling Joe, I have you figured out now. Yeah, and the dive kick will do it. Kazunoko on three rounds straight after losing that first game over L.I. Joe. Looking to move himself into top eight here at Evo. It's been clean, James. Yes, the, 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 these last two games have been all Kazunoko. Joe needs to figure out a way to get something established. Wow, a crouch short, short to beat to the I wonder if that was DP, just didn't get the autocorrect. Oh, the reversal out, but a chase down. Kazunoko will not give Joe any space, and he really needs it. Yeah, Joe can definitely feel the pressure right now, but okay, able to build that space. Ooh, block just in time. Sticking out some more buttons. Joe doing a better job at intercepting now. Uh -oh. Jump over. There he goes. Kazunoko is in. Great, he just ducked under it. One more V-trigger dive kick will do it for Kazunoko. Didn't he's almost out. Confirm into the super, but he's going to be able to do it here. Spends so, the critical art. Is this enough to be able to take out Kami? Low health, 900 health. It'll not do oh it. My. Just needs one. And yeah, you see him back that she didn't want to get hit by the uppercut. That's a yeah, punish. Okay, yeah. That, yeah, that's punishable. So Kazunoko kind of just took the risk there, but you know what? He's okay with that because he was down so much, and he's coming into this round with a two-bar resource lead. Over Joe. And yeah, Joe's scared to throw fireball because of EX drill. Great first start to this game. Oh, he hit a button into that EX dive. Yeah, he thought it was going to miss. Okay, not hitting buttons in that sequence this time, but confirms into the drill, gets the throw. Close to stun. Oh, late tech from Joe. Because of that, there's a mix up. Oh, but from he the walked foot. into it. Kazunoko thought he was going to go to the other side. Challenge. Oh, air to air again. Joe gets the throw. And now he has it close to stun. Doesn't choose us not to keep the pressure up, though. Yeah, was scared of the V trigger. All right, Kazunoko going to be able to confirm. Maybe spend the oh. X. No. What a block again. Same sequence. And he's going to confirm it. Super. it. Is it? Is that? That's dead for sure. Li Joe is in top eight of Evo. L he makes it. I Joe, Long Island Joe from New York State has qualified for Evolution. Top eight, he has made it. U.S. player has made it into top eight. You can see the elation from Joe and all of his friends jumping up there and giving him a hug. No man deserves this more than L.I. Joe. You can see the emotion from him. And Kazunoko up there for the hug. Good sportsmanship from him, but what a showing from Joe. Just so pleased. That was crazy. What a, a rally from him so deep there. <laughs> and the fist bump <laughs> from Infiltration. You can see L.I. Joe is beside. I guarantee you he is so lightheaded right now. Like he can probably barely stand up at this point in time. Oh, oh. and there's his girl Cat coming up there, giving him the hug. L.I. Joe always having support from her. And a Cinderella story for Joe to make it all the way here. Lose that nail biter to Fudo. Does it. Beats Kazunoko. Even gets the hug. Man, what a what a showing from Joe. Great job to him. He'll be playing in Mandalay tomorrow. You can see this is the end that closed it out. And Joe, that block. What a block. That was it right there. That was an Evo qualifying block if I've ever seen one in my life. And even gets the confirm. You see him jump up immediately. He knew it was over. <laughs> and people on the stage already. And there it is, L.I. Joe has qualified, but you know, interestingly enough, three Nashes, Yukodon, Infiltration, as well as L.I. Joe now. Three Nashes, and you know, we've all been talking about Ryu,